This is Miss Vale from the Russell County Public Library in Jamestown, Kentucky. We are all still looking for things to do. We're pretty much still at home. So I thought we might try um, a family craft. You can do it together. We can't go to a restaurant. We have to go to the carryouts. So I thought this is what we're going to end up with, a carryout puppet stage. The puppets are going to be used coming up from underneath. You do your show with your puppets under here and it's around your neck. So, we are going to do one. I just happen to have this box at home. but. It's a really neat way to use your cereal boxes. We all have cereal for breakfast in the morning, right? And that box you go to throw away, save it. Maybe paint it or cover it with construction paper. And then, I just happen to have mine painted ahead of time. Take the front of it, this way here, and we're gonna cut out, you might draw, leave just a little edge on there. So we could remove this, Parents, this is your part to help. You have to cut off that. So now we have this opening. This will be our stage. But you can't have that in the back like that. So we're going to take some construction paper. And what I did to measure it I took the whole sheet of paper and just kind of folded it down and then you get the creases where you cut. So I cut it the size to go in the back. A little glue stick. And cardboard. Kids love using glue sticks. They'll love this part. Slide that in there. Kind of press it down all around the edges. And now we have a back, our background color. Now, before we do the rest, we'll go to the bottom of the box, the same as we did in the front. Just leave a little space and cut a long rectangle. Got mine just about done. This is going to be the place where your puppets enter the stage. <laughs> okay, we've got bottom done. Now the sides kind of need to be covered too. You can see them. So let's get that glue stick out again. Put lots of glue on it. And do the same as we did on the bottom. Kind of measure the box, cut a piece off. And just kind of slide it in there. Do the same on the other, kind of measure it again. Fold your paper down, it'll give you the creases to cut. More glue sticks. Just kind of push your paper in there. Nice and tight up against the side. doesn't have to be perfect because you've got these edges here that kind of cover it. Okay, so now our inside is all blue. Our background is blue. We've got our hole in the bottom for the entrance of our puppets. And since this is called a carry-out puppet stage, we can take it anywhere we want. We're going to put 
a little strap on it like this so we can hang it around our neck and do our puppets from that way. So you can use um, yarn or string or anything, but I just happen to have some ribbon. So I poked a hole in each end in the top, and I'm just going to push that down through there with the paintbrush and knot it. You could put a bead or something on it to keep it from going through the hole, but I think a knot will do. Pull it back up. That's one side. We'll do the same on this one. This is a nice, safe way. You don't have any really sharp objects. Same on this side. Knot it a couple times. And then kind of check, make sure. Oh, uh oh, that didn't work. <laughs> Not a big enough fat. There we go. Okay. And put it around your neck. For kids, you want it to be kind of short because you want to be able to work with it. So, now that's kind of boring. Let's put some grass on the front of it. You could put anything on the front. I just kind of think grass pretty much covers any puppet show. Our glue stick again to just cut some grass. There we are. Okay, now we've got our little theater done. I took four puppets. This will be the story of the little red hen. And once again, it doesn't have to be great paper. I use scrap paper as long as one side's plain. This is a no cost thing. And you just color those, put them on a stick, popsicle stick, save your popsicle sticks, wash them, and then you can use them for this or buy some at Walmart. Tape them on, and then you can do your puppet show. Let me see. This one is adult size. So you can do your puppet show like this. And you can take it anywhere, anywhere. It's our carry out puppet stage. So, doesn't hardly cost anything at all. Do it together with your family and have fun. And we'll see you later.